I'd like to welcome you guys back to part three of Mafia Definitive Edition. Now, the last two videos did great. Loving this series so far. Dude, I can't wait to hop back into it. Look at that beautiful background. Oh my god. I'm hyped. I can't wait for more. Without further ado, let's roll right back into it. Alrighty, we are back on track, boys. Let's see what this is over here. I haven't seen this yet. No shows. No shows. Counselor's son is slain. Oh, who would that be? I wonder why. You guys can pause and read that if you want. Oh, back out of here. Go see Vinny. I'll meet you here. Third, yeah, third. Let's go, man. I heard about the misfortune, Tom. We're gonna fix it. Can't be messing up all the time, bro. Heard you in the market for something that goes boom. Where'd you get this, bro? Just stuff that in my pocket real quick. Not today, Benny. Alrighty. Driving the old two-seater. Don't go any place yet. Gotta hear me out on this. It's about the girl. Michelle? Right. You don't have to rub her out. Just make her disappear. You know her? Yeah. I've been with her a few times. She's a good egg, Tom. Just maybe not so bright. She doesn't deserve to get plugged just because she likes listening to me talk. You think she'll leave town? When she understands what'll happen otherwise. Yeah, she'll leave. Here's a hundred. Give it to her. And make sure she gets far away. Okay, sir. I'll see what I can do. It's all I'm asking. Let's go. Okay. Alright, so we're... Michelle. We're gonna ask not to. She's the one from the racetrack, right? Tom, that was the last time we're ever gonna talk about her. Ever. I told you what I had to ask, and you listened. Gotta leave it there. Okay. Yes, sir. I feel like Tom's a good guy, honestly. Keep your head when you get in the hotel. Find your mark and don't act suspicious. The manager thinks he's untouchable. You can probably walk right up to him. Anything else I should know? Nah. Just don't take all day. A lot of died young, so there can't be much to say about him. When the bomb goes off, I'll do my thing. Got it. What kind of world is it that when you screw up, you get sent to a cat house? Well, I have to clean up your mess at a funeral. You see the justice in that? I see a job I gotta do. Such a professional. Just try to finish a job this time, huh? Holy boy, that was a jab at us. First time I've been to a church in a while. Well, I'm gonna guess they're still singing the same songs. Last time I went, it was. Same songs I always heard as a kid. Yeah, you're not the religious type. It's the funerals, Tom. That's all it ever is. All that anyone ever wants to do is point guns at the family and shoot. Game point, there were so many funerals, I just stopped going to most of them. They're all boring as hell. Well, that's a shame, seeing as you're always dressed for the occasion. Great gag, Tom. Write that one down. Thanks. I'll do that. <laughs> now, weddings. Weddings are less boring. I'd go to one of them. You working on that? Yeah, I guess so. Good. Because I've given up waiting on Polly. Guy couldn't get a broad to stick to him if they went swimming through glue. Ah, he'll find someone. Tom, if his own mother has given up hope, then you can give up hope too. Dude, there is so many police around every corner. This dude's gonna turn, isn't he? Don't turn! Yeah, you better stop, pal. You know who the big dog is. Alright, we're getting close. Come on, please. Here's your step. I'll give the family your condolences. Good luck. You too. Huh. Alrighty. There's this one right around the corner. Oh no. We go the wrong way, pals. You must see. Oh no. 
Whatever. <laughs> We're running. Dude, I did not know that the car would get stuck like that. Salve. Hmm. My dude is booking it down the street. Look how fast he's going. Especially dress shoes, my lord. All right, I think we're getting close. Oh, you watch yourself, lady. All right, here we are. Carleone Hotel. Hey, you behave yourself in here, okay? Yes, sir. Hey, handsome. You here for a girl, drinks, or a mix of the two? A girl. And I got some business with your manager, too. A girl I can help you with. Come through. Find a girl you like. And you can both get better acquainted upstairs. There's no rush. So get a drink. Relax and enjoy yourself. Hey, good afternoon. Here for business. Oh. I need to talk to the manager. Yeah, head straight through to the lounge. You're with our uh, new business partners, I assume. Huh. Okay. Straight through the lounge, huh? Manager in the lounge. Okay. The friendship between the Colleon Hotel and the Morello family will be long and fruitful. So how many of these dudes are right here? And so I just started blasting. Find ammo relatively quick. What's in here? Some poopers. Nope, we're rolling. We got plenty of ammo now. Let's get this health kit. Where's he at? Lady, uh, let's keep rolling. Get One more. Where's that other guy? I hear him somewhere. I don't know if he's upstairs or not. Quick one. See something over there. Let's see. Go through here. Yes, sir. Okay, that leads right back into the kitchen. I believe that's a kitchen. What is this? Two oh eight. Sorry, I had to read that real quick. Let's, uh, what's over here? Detective magazine. Let's keep rolling. So, I'm assuming this is first floor, second floor is 200s. We're gonna roll up here. Oh my god. Jesus Christ, you go, you, you run at a guy with a boomstick. Go ahead. Alrighty. 
So what what are these? This is one. So we gotta go up again. I go up one more. Keeping the shotgun on me, man. This thing destroys. Sorry. Um. What's this? Oh, I thought I could. Uh, no, we're not going in here. I don't know if there's any health or not. Let's keep rolling through here. There's health in this back room. We're gonna get this real quick. Nothing. Cool. It's kind of nice that they're showing us where health is. Honestly. I assume it'd be easier, well just not easier, but uh, better to do it on a higher difficulty. You Michelle? What's it to you? A fella named Sam is one of your regulars. Maybe there's a lot of guys named Sam. You know him. Works for Don Celieri. Maybe you got him talking about our business from time to time, and maybe Don Morello offered you some money to spill what you heard. No, Sam, trust me. I, I don't say nothing. He knows that. Well, Don's losing a lot of money because someone <laughs> can't keep their mouth shut. I was just pumping guns with some of Morello's girls. I didn't mean nothing by it. Tell him I'm sorry. Tell him I won't never open my mouth again. I know him. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. You scared then? Good. Don't you ever forget how it feels to be this scared. To know you're just one twitch away from a hole in the ground. Because if you ever show your face in this town again, they're going to find you with two in the head. Do you understand? Lucky for you, Sam's got a big heart. Get dressed and make tracks. This place is gonna blow soon. Thank you. Just don't come back and we're square. Cool, man. You took the ladder of the option. That's that's smart. What's this say? Uh, it's the same two or anything. Let's keep rolling. Well, that shotgun again, man. I am not gonna be caught red handed with no weapons in my hand. Let's keep rolling through here. <clears throat> I feel like there's just a lot of these different rooms that you could just roll through. There's nothing really in them. Or stick to the main objective here. Over here! Oh man, I get him. Is he on these stairs? Are you a blast dude, pal? Oh, he's above me. Okay. Exaggerated, pal. There you go. One eyed Willy. Over here. Oh, there's ammo back there. What room is that in? You just have ammunition sitting in the middle of the room. You're wild. Hopefully, no more surprises.
is that? What is that on the ground there? Ah, no, no, no. That's a Tommy gun, man. Nice, bud. I need ammo. Alright, let's roll through. No, no, no. We're gonna run through here. Dude, the combat is super smooth. Everything. It's Love it. Not what it looks like. Oh. Disappointed. Okay. Alright. What's this? Read note. You guys can pause and read anytime you like. Let's see here. Another thing. I don't know what that was I grabbed. Is there a safe? No. You guys can pause and read that too. Right here, the big boy's office. Got four more rounds. Is that other guy down? Ooh, that was a nice shot. Alrighty, let's keep rolling. It reminds me of the uh, Red Dead Redemption 2. I might put that on there, dude. That, that game is so amazing. through the slums, boys. I am on it. I don't know if he kicked that ladder back just so people couldn't follow him. No or what? On the roof. Full health. Feels like we lost him. We're gonna keep heading. Down. I think we're at the church, where um our one boy is at. So hopefully, hopefully everything goes to plan because there is cops everywhere. No matter how far we've fallen, we can find redemption in death. Now William, he was a sinner, yes. But he was also a loving son, a protective brother, and a loyal friend. And for those virtues, we pray that his soul will find salvation. And now I believe one of Billy's 
closest and dearest friends would like to say a few words. Thank you, Father. I, uh... I just wanted to pay my respects. Billy, I never said this, but... I consider you my brother. I can't even count all the times you saved my ass from a beat. So I don't know how I'm good. What are you doing? Wait, that's the guy. That's the guy who killed Billy! Yeah! Oh my lord. Please! Jesus, what was Billy involved in? Some bad stuff. That dude is tailing me down. I get out of here. How am I on fire? You could have stopped all this days ago. His father. cover. His mother. There. This is the way this city works. I am hurt, man. Throw some flames! Warm it! Alrighty. We gotta follow him back over. Let's do this. Have you done? Murder in the house of God. These men were criminals, Father. Thieves. Rapists. Killers. And God would have embraced them if they'd asked for forgiveness. Now, which one of these men might have sought redemption by working with the poor? Which one might have saved just one life? None of us, Father. You bastard. If you have any confessions to make, you better do it quick. No more bloodshed, please! I'm sorry, Father. <sighs> Consider this an act of divine retribution. Okay. That make us even? Sure. For now. For your trouble, Father. I don't want your blood money. You took theirs. Not a lot of difference from where I'm standing. There should be enough dough to patch up the bullet holes and keep you quiet. <sighs> when the cops come, you tell them the gunman who did this had East Coast accents. Must have been from out of town, right? I won't lie. But I won't say anything at all. Good. Be a shame if we had to come back here. Where the hell were you? As <sighs> soon as I walked in the church, the crew recognized me. Followed me straight back out. Where are they now? The same place as all these guys. Come on, we gotta go. Holy moly. Form a perimeter around the church, boys. Don't let him out. We're standing here. Are you kidding? Reloading her. We got help everywhere. Let's go. Got three stars now. I don't want to waste any more ammo. Well, today didn't turn out like I expected. Just drive. Or we'll end up in the back. Freaking 
cutting these fingers, bro. Who's in the back of the hearse? Whatever you did at the cat house got the cops plenty pissed. Yeah, it was messy, but I got everything done. Everything? Yeah. Everything. Oh, man, just get me out of here. Try to pit me. Get them off our backs. Watch out. We need to watch out the power. Come on, Tommy. Lose them. I'm, I'm trying, trying to. guys which is pretty far away I believe from uh, wherever we are from little little Italy He's gone. Go back to patrols. okay we lost them <sighs> thank Christ gonna be trying to forget today for a long time you're telling me let's get back to the bar we gotta lie low the way this all went down we gotta lie low for weeks ah, the priest will keep his trap shut don't worry Morello got a bloody nose you and Polly are in the clear for whacking Galati's son. Boss will be pleased. I don't know, man. That was a big freaking... That was just a massive, just, I guess, misunderstanding. But that did not go well at all. There was a lot of people dead back there, bro. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Let me roll through here. Dude, this game is just super awesome. Trying to get away from those police, man. I wonder if they notice like what vehicle you were in last. I don't know if that's how it goes or not. We're back to the shop, boys. Thanks again, Sam, for helping me out back there. I thought my time was up. It's not anything you wouldn't do for me. I know, but when you come that close to biting it, Christ, it's something. Don't need to tell me about that. Just don't think about it. Best lesson I could ever teach you. Don't think about anything. Just do. Don't think. Just do. The Saint in the Center, chapter complete. Look at that little emblem at the top, man. That's wild. Intermezzo, 1938. This must be where they're talking again. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Tommy. You're confessing to a shootout in a church. And I ain't even through the hard stuff yet. You know, I could take you in right now, put your ball in bars, and tell you old and gray. Maybe. If you think you can make any of it stick. But then you'd never know about Murillo. Hey, fellas. Sorry to keep you waiting. My shift just started. What you having? Two lunch specials, please. And more coffee. You know what? Let's bring the whole pot. All right, we've come this far together. What kind of heat did you get from the church? It's a strange thing. Nothing really came of it all. Always figured Celieri paid off someone somewhere because it wasn't even in the papers. We just had to lay low for seven, eight months. The cops kept showing up at the bar just to remind us they were watching. And Frank caught wind that Morello was helping Galati get reelected, hoping he'd go after the Don. We well, recovered some account books from Morello's offices. 33 was a pretty good year for him. Bastard knew we were bleeding out before we did. 
While we were busy keeping our heads down, he started moving in on our rackets. Quiet at first, a few trucks go missing. Uh, top burner has one too many highballs, drives off a bridge. One of our regular pickups suddenly closes up shop, moves upstate. You need didn't catch on? Not me. I think maybe Polly smelled something. But even with the cops looking over our shoulders and Morello circling, we were still making good money. And with the Dom worried about keeping the heat off, we didn't have much to do, except drink, have a few laughs. And every time I went into Celieri's, there was Sarah. So it was a good year. Until Frank. A Coletti, a Don's consigliere. Yeah, that's right. He set me straight. He set us all straight. There's a lot of buzz around town about you guys. Yeah, we got into a little scrap last night. It's no big deal. I don't care about the bar fight, Tom. I care how it looks when you walk into a club and buy everyone around. Uh, we gotta do something with that, though. Then blow it at the track on Sunday. Or take a dame to a show. Or invest it, for Christ's sake. <laughs> you want me to become one of those Wall Street boys? <laughs> don't sass me, Tommy. I'm trying to teach you the ropes so you don't get strangled by them. You ever have a dog, Tom? Sure. A little mutt when I was a kid. When I was eight or nine, before I came over from the Sicily, I had this beautiful, skinny Cherneco de Letna. Like a little greyhound. Fastest dog you've ever seen. That's how I met the Don. We started setting up races together, betting on her with coins and rifle shells. There wasn't another dog that could catch her. She never lost. Until the day she did. We were only out of pocket knife, but... I never saw the Don so angry. She got old on you? No. Pregnant. She went into heat, got out of the yard, and every dog in town had a turn. You're like that dog, Tommy. Every time you flash your money around, you're a bitch in heat. And everyone in that club is now looking to fuck you. And once you get fucked, you're no good to us. Do you understand? Uh, you made your point. Good. Because you need to think about your career here. Look, police at his ceiling. He's the guy we want in a tussle, but he's not smart enough to run anything. Sam is loyal, but he has no vision. But you, Tommy... ...you could run this town someday. Well... ...I appreciate that, Frank. So... Uh, ...what happened to the dog? The Don tried to drown her. I broke his nose. You can let me off here. Give Sarah my best, Tommy. A trip to the old country, 1933. Oh, man. Back then. Everything went through Frank. The plans, the orders, the money. You could get the call day or night. Ah, Tommy. Frank says to wait for him in the garage out in the back, eh? You got the job, I think. Thanks, Luigi. Sarah's cooking. She's bringing something over. In this rain? <laughs> She's a good girl. I'll see you tomorrow, Luigi. Can we roll through here? Oh, yes, we can. That's why the door is open. All right, let's keep rolling. Yeah, sure. Back in the day, when the boss was still with Pretty me. smart those dudes aren't sit, like, sitting out in the rain. Little details. Thanks for waiting, Tom. But Don and I had to go over last month's numbers again. Sure. So what's the job? 
I want you to help Sam and Polly with the shipment we've got coming in tonight. The good stuff? Straight from Canada. Where do you need me? Sam's gone to meet our friends from the north at a farm outside of town. Polly will oversee the trucks bringing the shipment into the city, but I want you to go with him. Be an extra pair of eyes. Make sure it all goes smoothly. Okay. Get the car from Ralphie and meet Polly at the warehouse. He's got heaters in case you run into any trouble. Sure, Frank. No problem. Good. Now bring the Canadian home safe, Tommy. There is already a case earmarked for the Don. All right, I guess we're rolling. So, Ralphie. Oh, we're Working talking. late, Ralphie. I says his sleep when for for Frank sleeps. Man, he's been w working us hard. Morello's taking bites out of business everywhere else, Ralph. Booze racket's where we shine. We gotta stay ahead someplace. Ah, well, I, I just f f f fixed the cars that time. I, I changed the p p plates again. You can't be too careful. See you in the morning. Okay. I feel like we're the only ones that's nice to that guy. Let's get rolling. Now, the last video, I didn't have the music playing. Was, uh, I guess there is a copyright issue with one of the songs or whatever song it is. And I don't want my stuff to get messed up again. So I apologize again, guys, if there's no music playing or you guys don't hear anything. Not much I can do. Not much I can freaking do. So you just get to hear the quiet rain and sadness. It is what it is. That does suck, though, man. I mean, they make everything look good in this game, though. I mean, even the rain looks, like, more realistic. Imagine this thing with, like, ray tracing. My lord. If only. Just keep it rolling through here. I don't make it hit by a hit with a cop real soon. I'm doing nothing, buddy. Rolling through. Big old bridge. I wonder if they modeled this after any of New York, or even if this is New York. This might be like, uh, like maybe even Chicago, or I don't want to say uh, Cali. Cali's too too warm for all that, a lot of sunny. So either Chicago or freaking New York, man. Oh, we're all fat. Dude, where they have us going? My god. One side of the map to the other, buddy. I want to thank you guys again, honestly, all of you guys that sit down and watch my content. Maybe it's a, you know, a weekend. That's the only time you really get to watch anything. I, I appreciate it. Honestly, I do. I know these are simple videos I put out and everything. Dude, I just, I love video games. Driving passion of mine to put this stuff on the channel. I do have a couple titles coming up that I've, I've been thinking about, honestly, putting on the channel, and uh, you're in for, for a good ride, honestly, a real good ride. Lost Havens voted dry, of course it is. Come on, Tom! Watch it, pal. Just dry it out. Sorry. You know this place? Oh, uh, yeah. We've done a few pickups at the farm before. Don't worry. There ain't nothing but cow shit and shine out here. It's gonna be an easy few clams. Boys will load up the trucks, and we'll come straight back. Yeah, let's make it quick. I got some place to be. Ah, uh, you see it sooner or later. 
<laughs> Luigi's little girl, your night shift. <laughs> You're something else, pal. Protecting the girl's virginity one day and taking it the next. Lay off, Polly. Ah, oh, come on. I'm just kidding. She's a good girl. You settle down, she'll straighten you right out. I'm going home to a couch. <laughs> That's messed now, up. I wonder what kind of story she could tell about her old man, though. Luigi was a stone cold killer back in the day. I wouldn't know. You know she's been helping out behind the bar since she was a kid. I bet she's seen and heard a few things. Probably knows more about our business than we do. She knows enough not to ask me too many questions. That's good. She won't ever make a liar out of you. Christ. You ought to marry her just for that. God damn it. Sam should be waiting here, but I don't see him. Something smells off. Don't let your P.E.K.K.A. get all shriveled up. Probably just trying to get out of the rain. Or into the bootleg. <laughs> That'll wake him. He ain't coming. Okay. Let's go find him. That bastard is just three sheets, and I'm wrecking a new suit for nothing. I swear I'm gonna kill him. Here, just in case Frank was right. I'm gonna go grab them boys, get them sorted out. You go ahead, see what's what. We'll catch up with you. So it's like the start of every horror game. Oh man. I like it. Let's roll through here. We got a big area of the map to figure out. Big yellow circle. Someone's been waiting here tonight. One quarter out of work. Guys can pause and read that. Unemployment stands at 25%. Holy moly. Still not as high, still not as, you know. Low as today's standards, I guess. Oh well. Let's keep rolling through here. Dude, I was about to say that is the sturdiest. Is there another one over there? Let's roll through here. We got a couple question marks we want to hit. Give us a little yeah, bit more clues. To keep this place in check. Don't even pretend to farm now. Yeah, they, they know what's happening out here, honestly. This don't feel right. Doesn't look right. Why is there an axe in there? Lost Haven, Illinois, June 17th. Harry Smith. So it is Illinois. Okay. So basically Chicago. Harry Smith, missing for two months, was confirmed dead today by Lost Haven County Coroner Office. The fruitless search led by the farmer's father and neighbors ended several weeks ago. The grisly discovery of the body was made by local children looking for edible mushrooms and berries in Woodland Local to Cops Farm. The death is not being treated as suspicious due to how Mr. Smith's body was found hanging by the neck. He is survived by his elderly father. That has got to be rough, man, hearing that. Your kid did something like that. What kind of guy shoots a dog? A sick puppy does. A sick puppy. There's too many spots for people to look through stuff. I see truck headlights over there. Where the hell are you hiding? That's a good question, man. It's creepy. Let's get over here and look. I gotta head there first. We're gonna see what's behind here. Okay, so there's heels. We don't need heels. Another shotgun, pistols. I guess we'll roll around here. Hey, buddy. Jesus. Drop your weapon. You first. 
We don't have time for this. Sorry, pal. Guess we're doing this the hard way. Okay, then. Get over here! I got him pinned down! Take it cover! Oh, come on, reload. Dude is just one hand in a freaking 45 for a little boost. Dude, I need ammo. There's more rounds for this. Or oh, these are 50s. Yep. Nothing about this feels right. I mean, we just figured that out, didn't we? Can it cousins meet at usual place? Uncle is happy. The gift is on the way. That's probably the same thing. Yes, there's a setup. So we got nine rounds for the pistol, 33 for the the submachine gun. What is this? Not here. Let's go check in here. See what's up with this. What's this guy? Poor He's dead. Must have taken longer to die. So what are we missing? Investigate the ambush. Okay, so we have one more thing. Must have passed this up the first time. Wow! Oh! It's me, Tom. Polly, what took you so long? We're looking for Sammy. Did you find him? Nah, not yet. Just him. Canadian crew. Dollars to donuts to rest the face down in the dirt, too. Oh, Christ. The cops, Tommy. Well, how would I know? They didn't show a badge. God, they didn't say anything. They must be in Morello's pocket. This bastard. He can't even let us have this one racket. Forget about it, Tom. You gotta find Sam and get out of here. I mean, I'll say, dude, who knows if he's in trouble or if he's hurt or anything. Border Patrol. That's LH, that's Lost Haven. Okay. These guys are the real deal. They gotta be cops from the Border Patrol. Fuck. They've come heavy, all right. Make Lost Haven PD look like pussycats. Okay, so we're walking slow. In the rain. Dude, you gotta imagine how heavy that trench coat is. I mean, my god. It's probably like full leather. Okay, Not leather. We search the farm, Cut. We find Sam, we get the hell out. Anyone else, we slip him the bump. You get it? I want to see if there's any ammo, man. It'd be nice to have a full, yeah, full magazine or whatever of this. Sam! Sam! Where the hell are you? You want to quiet down, Polly? Oh man, there's a lot of blood. Not looking good. Not looking good. Oh, that's terrible. All shot in the back of the head. Must have been lined up. See another dude dead in there? Poor bastards. We got Molly's. Molly Tubbies. What is this? Okay, this is personal description. S signal it? Whatever it is. Oh, those must be the Canadian um, things, whatever they are. Let's keep rolling. The uh, circle moved in over there. You hear something? Man, look at this atmosphere. 
Okay. We got more ammunition for the submachine gun. What's this? Another detective magazine. Sweet. I have it on good authority that Salieri's whiskey handover is tonight. Our mutual friend wants this line of Canadian booze coming into the city shut down. I want you and your men at the farm we discovered by 9 p.m. Wait through the night and tell the boys it's fine if things go rough. They can take some hooch home to thank them for coming so far south. Good yeah. hunting. Quarter cops doing Morello's dirty work. Okay, so we got everything in here. I think this goes out to the main room. Yes, sir. Public sale, 1933. What a time to be alive. There's something up in that barn over there, Tom. Hey, you move, pal. Fighting, but I hear see ammo. Let's grab this real quick. Okay, that's the same thing we've seen on the wall over there. No different. SMG is more for like crowd control. Oh yeah, buddy. Let's roll in here. Thank Christ. We gotta get to him. Boys, stay here and watch our backs. Plug anyone who gets within a hundred yards. Except us. Pretty got bad. You gotta make sure that you know you say that. Okay, just hang on. I'll go get the truck, then we'll take you to the doctor. Hey, hey, you're gonna make it, Sam. Tommy, mm. you stay here with him. I'll be back. I'll be back in a flash. Okay. We survived worse. You sure? You sure we have? Where'd all these guys come Shoot from? Where'd those guys come from, bro?
I don't know how that dude took so many rounds, bro. Count me out, Tom. I'm hurting over here. Jesus, this hurts. Jesus Christ. Ugh. Where's the goddamn truck? Crap, we got cops. Holy moly. Let's go, boys. So these guys are all paid off, too. It doesn't matter. I lied. This gun is sweet. Tony and Donnie too? Yeah. What a fucking massacre. How's Sam? Well, he ain't any worse. I'll go get him. Keep an eye out. This is heavy stuff now. Where the hell did I find that truck? Jesus, man. What if this was in the original one too? That that car just crashed. We're good over here. Eat it, buddy. Dude, you are not getting through that thing. That is like thick, thick metal. Holy bastard! My pedal is to the metal! Did we lose them? Two squad cars on us! Our friends got company! Good night, asshole! What is that thing? If I could aim straight, this would be a lot better. Ah, crap! They're right on our ass! Easy. Eat it, buddy. <laughs> yeah, buddy, we're free. Do they just, they're in every corner. Stuck here. 
Yeah, my dude is losing crazy health, man. I'm almost dead. Oh, Jesus. Oh, that's the big boy truck. Shit! I was shooting the wrong thing, wasn't I? I think they're lighting up, man. Just yamming them. Holy, we gotta lose them! What you get? We did it. Holy moly, man. <laughs> Sam's bleeding out, no good. Okay, we're here, Tom. You get Sam out. I'm gonna go wake up the doc. Sam, Sam. We made it. We're at the doctor's house. This is three, I owe you. Paulie, what the hell are you doing here so late? Uh, uh, evening, Doc. Sorry to wake you, but um, we had a little accident. We got an injured man out here. All right, bring him inside. Okay, thank you. Okay, I'll stay with Sam. You can take the truck back. Call it a night. No, I'll wait. The doctor already got his hands full. No sense of both of us breathing down his neck. Go on, Tom. I'm gonna be fine. Okay. Hey, you did good tonight. At least I heard it from somebody. Oh, man. That was a ruined night, honestly. They didn't get anything they were going after. They just shot up. Because this is not booming, boys. Not at all. Drive to Sarah's apartment. Okay. What was that? Jesus, man. Yeah, that was uh, that was a little hectic near the end there. Push that armored vehicle. I didn't know they had vehicles like that back then. Must have been like five stars completely. That was wild, bro. Dark Jury. Now you can just tell each scene is played just perfectly with the atmosphere and everything. If something goes wrong, you can tell by the scene of it. 
I'll speed this up a little bit. This game constantly has me looking at the mini-map. Not for like the G GPS thing, but honestly for the freaking cops. Like that guy. Just chilling there. Yeah, let me know what you guys think about this game so far. Honestly, man, it's a uh, it's a different approach to kind of like an open world. I guess I, I don't even would even call it a sandbox, but like an open world st storytelling game. I think it sets the tone perfectly. 1930s era style. Since it is in Illinois, it is Chicago, so. I thought I was right about it. I didn't know if it was New York or Chicago, but it's, it is Chicago. I can tell from, like, the bridges. Let's roll, boys. We could have used that guy earlier. Little EMS. We're not stopping at all, boys. The best breaks back then were three mile breaks. You're going over 80. You're stopping at three miles. Oh, that's sweet. Still like rain on the car from like going into the underpass. Or if that guy can see us on the road. We gotta go past the cop anyways. Yeah, man, our buddy got shot. And we didn't get any sales on what I, th I think they were selling booze. I think it was beer they were trying to sell or liquor. One of the two because of the uh, prohibition. Yeah, I'm coming through. Wait up. Hold up, buddy. Got here and take a walk. That dude isn't just sitting in the rain. He's having a worse day than me. Let's go. You're late. Dinner's cold. Work. She knows something's up. Just that straightforward. Gotta love it. So that is the chapter completed. A trip to the old, oh, to the country. Tell me why I thought that it said a trip to the old country as soon as that thing aired. Man, I am slow. I'm not gonna lie. Omerta. 1933. Hey, boss. I came as soon as I got your message. Sit down, Tom. We have a mole, Tom. No. Oh. I was up all night driving myself nuts trying to figure it out. 
I started thinking maybe it's one of our guys. We aren't paying his fair share. Someone with a light wallet. Maybe looking to Morello for a new suit. Frank wasn't around, so I went to the safe to get the account books. To see who's getting cents on the dollar he's earned. What do you know? The books are gone, Tom. Frank. Oh, shit. <sighs> More than 50 years I've known him. <sighs> Everything I have, I got with Frank. And every buck we've earned, every dime we've paid out, it's all logged in those books. Frank hands those over to the feds, we're finished. Frank respects one person in this whole town, and that's you. This has got to be some kind of misunderstanding. I've been calling him all day. I went by his place. He's gone. His wife and kid are gone. But why? I don't know. I'm sure he has his reasons. Maybe he's still smarting over the dog. But when you tried to drown? Yeah. <sighs> Same one I shot after he wouldn't let me sink her. Jesus. I was a stupid kid, Tommy. But grudge or no grudge, we gotta get those books back. Shake down all our stories. See who knows what. And when you catch up to Frank, you get those books. And if he doesn't have them on him, you make him tell you where to find them. After that, you do what we gotta do. Don't want me to whack him. Vincenzo's waiting for you with a clean car. Oh man, he's just throwing, throwing peanuts to the freaking birds. Oh man, so they want us to basically kill Frank, get all the documents back and everything. Man, that's tough. That dude gave us some good, good life advice, honestly. But I'm gonna end the video here, guys. Man, has it been a crazy video, honestly. Dude, it's been non-stop packed action. I freaking love every second of it. But, again, I'm going to have more videos popping up. I'm going to have definitely more tomorrow. At least, I hope, hopefully two. Hopefully two. At least one. But, I wanted to thank you guys again for watching. Love to all. And see you in the next one.